hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be unboxing some products from rosalyn they sent me they sent me some glitter poly gel so i'm just going to go ahead and swatch these for you they also sent me some gel polish so i will show you guys that as well um i don't have anything to swatch this on so i did swatch them on my little um candle top that i've been using as a nail art palette so i will show you guys what they look like um swatched were able to see this clearly I used the one in the middle today so um, I will do some more sets with the other colors so that you can see exactly how they look so now I'm just gonna go ahead and open the polishes for you guys so this is a dark blue like a royal blue I love this blue on my skin tone it just looks so nice um, I also got this pink, it's like a hot pink orange color. Um, I will be doing a set with these colors as well. I just wanted to show you guys what they sent me. Um, this color is a neon yellow. All of these colors are mostly neon that they sent, you know, because it's about to be summertime. So um, this one is also... What is this? Blue, baby blue. This one is the neon green. Also sent some slip solution they sent a brush and a dampen dish and y'all excuse the music in the background I was listening to Nicki Minaj I was cleaning up before I did this voiceover and I just remembered like oh snap I gotta do my voiceover but I was jamming y'all so <laughs> excuse my music So now I'm just going to go ahead and adhere the tips that I'm going to be using with some 4 and one base coat. And if you guys have not already, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video to someone who might like it. Thanks, boo.
I did print out a hundred dollar bill and I just cut the pieces that I wanted so I'm just trying to figure out how I'm gonna place this hundred one hundred dollars that's what it says um, I'm just gonna figure out how I want to place it i did add some base coat to the bottom first and um right here i'm just trying to see which one fits better but i had an idea for the middle finger so i just decided to put it on the thumb <laughs> went ahead and finished carrying that in the lamp now I'm just gonna go ahead and apply some gold flakes um, I'm just gonna put it around After applying the gold flakes, I'm just going to go ahead and use the clear poly gel from Rosalyn and cap that. I'm just going to encapsulate it, so that's what I'm about to do now. So now I'm going in with the glitter poly gel. Um, it's more of like a greenish bluish color, which I felt like it would be great because you know $100 bills, they're green, but now they have that blue strip on there. So um, that's why I decided to use this color. poly gel was really easy to work with um, but I prefer to use the base coat instead of using slip solution um, the poly gel is really like soft it's not at all hard whatsoever it's not hard to work with so um, the slip solution kind of just made it sticky in a way so I just would recommend using base coat
after carrying in the lamp, I'm just going to go ahead and add in God the trust. And I cut them up into separate pieces because I'm just going to place them wherever I see fit. going to go ahead and add some gold flakes between the words and then I'm going to encapsulate that as well. So now for the middle and the ring finger, I am going to be putting base coat first and then I'm going to put the face on these two nails. After making sure they were aligned, I went ahead and cured that and now I am just capping with the clear poly gel from Rosalind again. So this time I put the gold flakes on afterwards. Um, I did that because I laid the poly gel really good 
on top so I'm not gonna have to file on top of the nail at all I'm just gonna have to file on the sides and make sure um, the tips are really straight how I want them but other than that like I didn't have to go in and file on top at all So now for the pinky, I am just going to use that um, glitter poly gel again. just going to go ahead and apply some base coat and then add that little hundred on to the nail. So after carrying in the lamp, now I'm just going to go ahead and add some gold flakes. So this is how we're looking um, I did file off camera because I just didn't see a point of filing on camera um, it was gonna make the video really really long so here we are I'm dusting them off
here we are after curing in the lamp. Now I am just going to go ahead and add some cuticle oil and then I'm going to give you guys those angles because it wouldn't be a shade noted video without those angles. So here we are and of course I'm going to give you guys better lighting and better angles in the next clip. Here's those angles. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, this is the first time I ever did a money set. Um, I really love how they came out. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Um, go ahead and check out Rosalind. I have a link down in the description. Um, I will go ahead and link the direct link so that you can get money off. Um, also, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.